Hello guys, I welcome you all to Healthy Living with Regina Tete, where it is all about health promotion. Yes, so in the past few days, I told you I was going to share health experiences with you. Yes, we are going to be on the Vlogmas journey, but I'm going to do it in the form of health, to share health tips with you. Yes, so last year, I decided I was going to make certain changes in my life. I wanted to maintain my weight and ensure I have a free bowel. So I did, how, am I, how did I decide to do this? I wanted to take an adequate amount of water, exercise regularly, and take in more roughages. Yes, so I did this, put everything together, how I was going to do it. Let me just even tell you basically how I decided I was going to do it. When I wake up in the morning, yes, I'll take in water and then go for my jogging, come back from the jogging, prepare for school. During school, I ensure that I take adequate amount of water. After school, when I'm returning, I'll buy some oranges and come and eat. So at the end of the day, all three have been fulfilled, right? Here is one mistake I made. I forgot that I am making three major changes in my life and I had to take it one thing at a time, one day at a time. You may have heard this several times, but you would want to stay back and listen to how I didn't do this and how it's like I didn't succeed at achieving this. You may be like, oh, but these are very little changes, so what's the big deal? See, one thing I've come to realize is the way we do things right now, okay, the way you do your things right now is something you have been doing for a while, okay, and you have gotten used to it. It has become some kind of a natural habit. So no matter what you are trying to change about this, this particular way you do your thing you'd have to intentionally make a habit out of it and i forgot this one part forgetting that i'll need to take it one day at a time because no matter how little they may sound they are like three major changes if i am not used to exercising daily okay and i have to tune myself to exercising daily if i'm not used to taking oranges in the evening and i have to get used to doing that I hope you are getting the whole trend. I forgot this and I realized that at the point, I even forget that I, I told myself I'll be taking oranges in the evening. I told myself I'll be exercising daily. I told myself I'll be doing, you know, some of these muscle strengthening exercises. I even forgot entirely. Imagine being in school. Sometimes I just, I just forget that I had this resolution. So at the point, I asked myself why things weren't going well. And I realized that it was because I wasn't taking it one thing at a time, one day at a time. I think this could be a new mantra. You know, as you're doing a resolution, tell yourself one thing at a time, one day at a time. Make sure you have established this new habit, one habit that you would want to, you, you don't want to now form. Establish it, get used to it before you pick the next thing. Anyway, I'm speaking from experience, so if you can combine all, fine. But trust me, combining everything wasn't working for me. So what did I decide to do? Which one did I end up choosing? I decided to pick the hydration, okay? And one thing about the water is here, there may be a recommended amount of water, um, you are supposed to take to stay hydrated but i think it could be individualized in the sense that if you do depending on the kind of work you do if you sweat often okay and you're losing an amount of water you can't say oh for the i mean for today i've taken the recommended amount of water and although i'm thirsty because i've already taken the recommended amount i'm not going to take water no i doubt if that will help i i i doubt if that will help so your you being thirsty is your body trying to tell you that you are losing water and you need to hydrate yourself. Yeah, so there are recommendations, but then if you are thirsty, you need to drink water. Okay, yes, so with that being said, I decided to choose that and focus on hydrating myself. So whenever I'm going to school, I have a number of sachet water in my bag. Okay, so I, didn't, I told myself that I'll, go, I'll be taking between 7 to 8 sachet a day. Okay, yes, one sachet is 500 ml, so I decided to take between two, 7 and 8 okay but then even with that i didn't just start with trying to take seven to eight a day i had to get used to taking i mean consciously taking five you know after i've mastered that increased it to six okay so i'm sharing this with you for you to know that no matter the amount of no matter the kind of health change you want to make in your body please take it one change at a time one day at a time if it is what you want to lose please you need to take it one day at a time you wouldn't you wouldn't achieve the weight loss in just some few days that is if you want to use the exercise method as a way of losing weight you even need to check the amount of food you eat because if you are exercising and yet you are eating more than you are losing it's like you are doing what i would say is cost 90. okay you will talk about all those exercises later today is me sharing my experience with you about trying to take um, the change you want to make one day one change at a time one day at a time thank you so much for watching and i will see you 
another time please do subscribe please do stay and please do return do share this video with other people so other people will also be informed so people won't just draw changes or they don't to work on their skin work on their weight forgetting that you have to work on one change establish it get used to it and then you take it you take the next one okay let me know what you think in the comment section i'll see you in the next video do have a nice day bye